and welcome. This is Chandni Nevdani and you are watching It's Tomorrow News. Super Typhoon Hagibis heads towards Japan. Super Typhoon Hagibis has developed quickly in the Western Pacific, strengthening from a tropical storm to a super typhoon in just 24 hours. This makes Hagibis the 20th storm in the region this season, among the most explosive rapid intensifications of any tropical cyclone on record. On Sunday, to the same time on Monday, the system's winds went from 100 km per hour to 250 km per hour as its center near the Northern Mariana Island of Anatahan. Only Atlantic hurricanes Patricia and Wilma are known to have strengthened more quickly. Super Typhoon Hagibis is now located approximately 380 kilometers northwest of Guam. It has sustained winds of 250 kilometers per hour and gusts of nearly 305 kilometers per hour. It is already equivalent to a strong Category 5 Atlantic hurricane and is expected to strengthen over the next 24 hours with winds touching 260 kilometers per hour. The storm is expected to continue northward before veering off to the northeast. Mainland Japan appears to be most at risk of a direct impact from Hagibis. However, there is no clarity as to where the worst impact will be. Hagibis will be weakening as it nears Japan because of the increasingly unfavorable upper level winds. That said, it should still be a strong and dangerous typhoon. Honshu is likely to be the worst hit. The latest projections take the eye of the storm right over Tokyo. The storm could still be equivalent to a Category 2 hurricane by then with winds at approximately 160 km per hour, gusting to 200 km per hour. Heavy rain is likely for much of the day and 200 to 300 mm of rain is possible by the weekend. One or two places could see even more. Along with the damaging winds and torrential rain, large waves and storm surges are likely to cause life-threatening floods and possibly mudslides leading to widespread disruption. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Chani Nevnani. For more weather updates, do like, share and subscribe our channel.